Hi guys, this is James from Bespoke Airsoft and I want to address a really important concern with the Ares Striker Amoeba uh, sniper rifles. Now there's been a lot of information going around recently in the US with Elite Force uh, condemning the Striker, saying it was uh, an unsafe gun to use, then people got on the bandwagon like Airsoft GI and Airsoftology. First thing I want to say to those guys is educate yourself. You clearly have no idea what's going on with this sniper rifle. Us here in the UK have sold hundreds of these rifles, as many as other retailers in the UK, and all those over Europe. No one has had this issue that's going on, and basically what they're saying is the gun's unsafe, and if you drop it, it goes off. Bit of information for you here. A lot of sniper rifles that are used in Airsoft today use a, uh, a similar type sear system that if they were dropped from 6 metres or whatever you're saying, 6 foot, they probably would go off as well. So this is absolute nonsense. There's nothing to worry about with your strikers. Um, if you go back to our other videos and see where we show you how to adjust the trigger, trigger sear properly, which some of these uh, companies should do, um, then go and have a look at that and it will teach you how to get rid of the slam firing that comes from the factory. And all it is is when the trigger sear uh, adjustment screw is wound in too much to like lighten the trigger pull, it will make the gun, the gun slam fire. So you just wind that trigger screw all the way out and it's absolutely fine. Another note, who drops a gun from six feet really and worries about it going off? I can bet you any money that my VSR, if I dropped it from six foot, there's a high probability that it'll go off. It's just the way the sears work. Inertia, smacking the sears down. Come on guys, it's it, it's simple. There's a lightest of trigger pulls, which pushes a sear down. You drop the rifle from high enough, it's gonna do that. So these are scare tactics by these US companies. Um, Elite Force will probably bring out their own variant of the Striker sniper rifle. Um, say it's a Gen 2 like they did before, but there's been no information to back any of this up whatsoever, so no need to worry, carry on using your striker sniper rifles as you should, and please share this video to get this round there to show everybody that this is absolutely nonsense. I'm James from Bespoke Airsoft, and thank you for tuning in.